Yo, what's going on, boys? We're back here with some Mashoko Tensei. We're on episode three. I'm um, really excited to get into this one. If you haven't already, make sure you guys subscribe because we're carrying on the show and doing it every single week about three to four times, I think. We had Roxy ditched us. We're sad about that because I liked Roxy. And now I don't even know where the fuck we're going from this point in time. So it's a complete mystery. Excited for this. If you guys want these uncut and early up to a month ahead of YouTube, patreon.com slash First thing in the description, we stream content live on Twitch every Monday to Friday, 4 p.m. EST, doing shows like Black Clover, uh, Full Moon Alka's Brotherhood, and Mob Psycho Season 2. If you want to check those out, stuff live, link to that's down below. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, they're just the same. <laughs> Bro, I want to see Rudy training with a sword. Low key more than the magic at this point. Man strength is showing off the kills. Hey, yo. Dude, just roast his dad. Shit. How long can he keep up sort of like the, the cute act and um, with the whole perviness and shit, you know? Surely they're going to at some point be like, yo, this is starting to get way too weird. Oh, what's this music, bro? Hey, this is cool. My boy going on a little adventure in town. Finally. Hi. So adorable. The thing I like about it, which I mean, lots of animes do, but the background is a lot more like blurry and blocky versus like foreground is like a lot more defined with lines. So it stands out a lot more. But I just really noticed it a lot in this anime compared to others. My boy is developing. He's not afraid of it anymore. Demon? Oh shit. No way. You gotta go save them. You bitch. The fuck? That's messed up. Sounds like a girl. Alright, beat the shit out of them. Go, Rudy. Fuck him up. Just with the magic. Woo! Ha <laughs> ha, bitch! What you gonna do about that? Wait, what? He said the wrong way? The fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, shit! Hey, yo, boys, you're gonna get fucked up. You try bullying some bitch? This is lame! Bitch, they're the ones who are lame. You alright? She's green here! <gasps> Did you just say wow? Oh. I no, no, chill, 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 chill. The ears. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, they're actually a demon. But they seem so nice. Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> I love when he just goes into like the, the English words. Like, okay, Seth. Seth. So this person doesn't know how to think for themselves, essentially. Don't know? Well, where are your parents now? Okay, so you are elves. Since that means you're just special, dude. Oh, I've had a hard life so far. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> oh god. At least Rudy's being kind to people. He doesn't have to like give a reason for it. <gasps> We're friends. Already we've made some? Hell yeah. That was quick. D dude, does he always think about this? Come on, man. No more questions, please. You don't have a name? Self? Aww. So adorable. Yo, this world is dark. So open. That Loki just reminds me of New Zealand. <gasps> With the magic? You want to learn? Ah, come on, you might as well. Now you can be the teacher. Full circle. Oh, come on, Rudy. Might as well. Ah. Oh, the little ears moved. <laughs> oh, they made it back home nicely. Safely. Is some fucked up shit going to happen? Oh, wait. He's here. Hi. No. Why? <laughs> the panties. Oh, is that? Hell yeah. Why would you be mad? You should congratulate us. What? What do you mean? Whoa, whoa. Damn it! The, the father's not even listening to his side of the thing. Really doesn't think Barnes is the only option. Oh shit! You talking back? Oh! Hey! You sure you want to do that, Rudy? That one there was a violation! Oh my god. Oh my god. Rudy just gets up from his like, ah oh, yeah. That's, is that all you got, bro? 
You won't even listen to a side, bro. <laughs> Imagine being like told about how to parent a child by your child. <sighs> oh, who the fuck? I was going to say I lost my point at the time. I imagine that probably happens a lot nowadays with um with parents, especially with the internet. Like, I think that a lot of kids, especially with TikTok and stuff, now will probably just chat shit 24-7 back to their parents. Well, most people are a bit entitled. But you got to respect that. you got to hear a side out. you got to jump to conclusions. Also, it's very much when you're a kid, you lie a lot. Let's be honest. It's a lot easier to lie a lot. Oh! <laughs> I love it. I love how he's just chatting shit. Hell yeah, four against one. You gotta make it fair at least. He's gonna hit you again for talking back, isn't he? The frustration from Paul right now. <laughs> you better make sure he doesn't hold resentment towards you though, really. That can happen pretty easily. And again, he's only learning. Give it up for Paul. Hey, yo, respect. Respect. I was almost relieved when he did something childish. Feels like he's not even a kid. Aww. I feel sorry for him. I feel like he's almost at the point where he doesn't really know what he can, like, teach his kid. He almost, like, feels a bit outclassed. As weird as that sounds, but over his head. At least you have the opportunity, though. Wait, really? No way, the fuck? Damn, that bitch is trying to ruin her marriage! Hey! What's up? Bro! How can you do that so quickly? Isn't it cheating whenever they use that, um, stone though? It's just like so casual for him, bro. Does he not want somebody to be the same as him? Oh, okay. I feel the show is just like so much like other isekais where there's just so much dialogue and so much stuff that's like world building that I don't really have as much to comment as like usual shows. Ooh. That was cool. <laughs> Wait. It might be somebody who's goaded as you? Imagine if it happens. You want a beginning, don't you? <gasps> oh no, it's happening. Oh, that was too quick. No way. Oh, they're just having fun. So I'm glad he's smiling now. Holy shit, that is big. This is too cute. I feel like we might need to do multiple episodes in a video for Shuka Tensei. Let me know if you guys want to see that. Now that I think of it, the old me had a childhood friend who was a girl. And he got married a while ago. Okay. <laughs> hey yo, fair enough. If, that, if that's, what, that's what gets you going. That's interesting. Alright, darker tones. Some shit gonna happen. They're gonna freak out whenever they sit here? Are we good? Are we gonna find out that he's like actually a girl? Man, just pulled up here naked. <laughs> hey, yo. You just came back to I can rub three out. Hey, that's a time to come back, Cynix. Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I mean, bro, you shouldn't like force this on this dude. Come on, Rudy. You know better than that. Wait, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> yo, man pulled out the bait and swish. Damn, that was quick. Bro. That instant. <laughs> the way he's describing this. <laughs> it was a she. Dun, dun, dun. The darker tones did come into play. At least this is a point now where it all ties back in and um, Paul can come back to sort of actually give some fatherly advice. Or at least just be there for his kid versus before, you know. He made a mistake and now just flip flops to Rudy making a mistake. Damn straight. Tell him. This dude should know that in the first place though. Around six months they've known each other. 
Yeah, that's true. Does he have to apologize in front of everybody? Please leave them alone for a second, man. How does that justify it? <laughs> this dude. It's like, oh shit! I thought you were a boy. That, that makes us okay. <laughs> what the fuck? I haven't seen some of this though. Aww. <laughs> Yo, that was quick. Oh, this is too good, man. Oh, the advice? I mean, that's true. I mean, it's... I mean, it's not... It's not necessarily like a bad thing, but you don't go about it like that. Oh god, okay. <laughs> this is so odd, I love it. <laughs> Make a clean breast of your worries in front of yourself. I've never heard that term in my life. Make a clean breast of your worries? The fuck? Chad, have you ever heard that before? <laughs> Should come to you. <laughs> Bro, Paul better not fuck up and do anything with anybody else. Yeah. I have a feeling with like everybody coming onto him in the village, like some shit might happen. All right, bro, this is too much. Man has negative gain, ayo. Clean breast means to speak openly and honestly about something. Oh, huh. I've literally never heard that before. Bro. <laughs> Could he seem more creepy, bro? Look at his face. Dude, the movement here. Look at him. Look at that smile. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the dad in the background. Be yourself, bro. That's all you need. Ah, oh, God, this is painful. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Uh, yeah, hey. The dad's like, hell yeah, I did something. <laughs> okay. That was an interesting episode. I, if I have to say so myself. I'm glad we sort of got to see the dynamic with the dad and Rudy. Um, the whole, you know, about them apologizing and then it just flip-flopping and then they both fucked up in each scenario but self seems cool like the whole demon thing might become a problem later on or in the future i imagine i'm curious like when do we meet or no when do we go explore this world like outside of just here because 23 episodes i feel like we gotta go on like some adventure type shit you know anyway boys i hope you enjoyed watching as always go check out the patreon if you want to be up to what they hit for these reactions and twitch is down below if you want to watch some content live with me monday to friday